right ball. to begin here. The alternating possession will go to Blenner Acid. quarter and it appears both starting lineups are back on the floor. Ball is inbounded by Balderson and immediately stolen by Madison's number 20 Noah Gebhardt. Gebhardt dribbles to the right corner where he is trapped and the ball is stolen but the alternating possession jump ball happens first. Ball will go to Madison. Ball is inbounded by Madison to the elbow, shot by Gebhardt. Gebhardt shot is missed, but rebounded by Jeremiah Welch. And an injury has happened. Caden Sterling, a player that is injured in the scrum. And the replacement for Sterling, the injured Sterling, will be Luca Graziani. Blue ball. Madison will have the ball underneath. Madison ball underneath. It appears that Sterling is going to be okay. But he does have to come out because they checked on him on the floor. Graber with the ball on the left wing. He passes to Hemingway. He passes it to the right corner to Gebhardt. Gebhardt looks to drive in line. Back to Graber. Graber drives in. Shoots. Ball off the rim. Rebound by... Welch, Welch puts it up no good and rebound for the Bobcats by Drew Davis. Parker Dobson dribble, kicks it out to Balderson who hits from the arc. And the basket is good. And we have a traveling violation on Hemingway as he brings the ball across half court and has pressured and Balderson will get the ball on the inbound. He will throw the ball to Dobson. And the Bobcats bring it across half court. Balderson to Eddie. Back to Parker Dobson. He shoots the little runner. No, no good. He gets his own rebound. Passes out to Eddie. He passes it to Case and Litton. Case and Litton. A little nice up and under dipsy do. How do you do? And Case and Litton. Gives the Bobcats a bigger lead of five points. Graber rushes the shot. Rebound by the Bobcats. Eddie who gives it to Litton. Litton turns. Forces up a shot. No good. Graber gets the rebound. Passes a few of the Bobcat players down the floor but has to pull it out. We have a trap in the corner. And Coach Barry Goldenberg calls timeout. I had the score backwards at the half. It was 15-14. Blunner has it with the lead. It is now 19-14. Blunner has it with the lead. Jeff. Jeff. All 
All right, so Madison will get the ball in Dead Man's Corner off the timeout. Let's see what Coach Goldenberg drew up here for the Dead Man's Corner inbound. Graver runs to the ball. Ball is inbound, and he gets the ball, and he pulls it back out. He surveys the defense. He looks to drive right. And the ball is stolen. Case and Litton driving down. Little jump pass to Parker Dobson. Dobson forces up a shot. No good. Rebound by Madison, number 30. Josh Eddy, who pushes the ball ahead to Xavier Graber. Graber shoots. It's no good, but he is fouled by number 24, Baylor Balderson. That is his third foul. The X man at the line for the Mustangs, and X puts the ball into the basket. X marks the spot and shoots the second foul shot, and it goes in as well. And it's a 19-16 ball game. And Litton brings the ball. Excuse me, Parker Dobson brings it across, passes to Balderson, who now passes to Litton. Litton drives down in. Shot is no good. But there is a foul on number one, Mason Hemingway. That is his second foul. Jason Litton eyes the basket, misses the first shot. And now for the second lift. Shot Jason Litton. Up shot. Ball rims out. That was about three-fourths of the way down. It comes out. Rebound by Madison. Graber quickly brings the ball up the floor again. Shot is no good. Rebound by Jason Litton. Now it's pushing the ball up the floor himself. A little behind the back dribble. Puts the ball up, but it's no good. Rebound by Madison. Graber gets the ball, pushes it ahead to Hemingway. Hemingway shoots, and there's a foul by Eddie. Josh Eddy with the foul. That is his second foul of the ball game. So the fouls are accumulating for the Bobcats. Ball is inbound to Graber. He dribbles off his foot. Ball is stolen by Balderson. Balderson to Litton. Litton to, uh, to Dobson. Parker Dobson puts it in the basket. 21-16. And Madison is now bringing the ball up. Graber directing the offense. Dribbles through the Bobcat defense. Dishes it to number 30 for the Mustangs. That is Hayden Sterling. Nice little pass by Xavier Graber. The X-Man marks the spot. Parker Dobson. Pass to Litton. He passes it back to Dobson in the corner who tries to do the little triangle offense, but it's to no avail. The ball is stolen. The ball is pushed ahead. And Hemingway gets the ball, but he gets he ends up committing the traveling violation. Ball is inbounded by Balderson. Balderson to Dobson. Back to Balderson. Balderson pulls up inside the three-point arc and gets from just inside the top of the key. 23-18. Glenner has it. Graber quickly brings the ball across. Ball is knocked out. Graber gets the ball. He is now fouled by number 23, Parker Dobson. That is his first foul in the ball game. Minute four left. It's Blinner has at 23 and Madison 18. Graber passes to Gerber. Back to Graber in the corner. He tries to pass it across, but he is fouled. Foul is called on number 24, Baylor Balderson. That is his fourth foul. And checking into the ball game for Blenner Asset, number four, Aiden 
Bowman. Bowman checks in for Balder. The ball is inbounded to Gerber. Excuse me, to Gebhardt, who shoots. Ball is short, rebounded by Parker Dobson. Parker Dobson drives the court. Shoots the shot and is fouled by Josh Eddy. Take that back out of the foul was by Hayden Sterling. That is his second foul. Parker Dobson at the line in the eyes of the basket and the first shot comes out. Dobson now at the line with the second shot. He puts the ball up. And again, it's no good. Rebound by Madison, number 30. Hayden Sterling, he pushes it to Graber. Graber pushes the ball ahead. Nice little give and go on the left side, but the ball doesn't go down. Rebound by Hayden Bowman, who pushes ahead to Kaysen Litton. Kaysen Litton in the paint. Little turnaround this to do, and how do you do? There's a layup. 25-18. Bobcat. Quickly, the Mustangs bring the ball up. This is the X-Man really brings it up quick. Does a little dribble around, wrap around, no good. Off the glass, rebound by the Mustangs. Sterling, it's still no good. And a no press violation is called. And the Bobcat them down the ball. Five seconds remaining. Pass to Jason Litton. Dallas Dobson in the right corner. He drains the shot at the end of the third quarter. And Blenner Hassett extends their lead. It is now Blenner Hassett 27 and Madison 18. Exciting 4-5 matchup tonight. And the winner will have a big game tomorrow as they will take on, whoever wins this ball game, will take on Williamstown at 5.30 tomorrow. Leonard Hassett gets the ball on the side out. They pass to Litton. Litton drives into the paint. And a blocking foul is called on Madison's number one, Mason Hemingway. Kaysen Litton at the line to shoot two. First shot is up. Short off the front rim. Litton with the ball on the second shot. He shoots. This time, nothing but net. And the lead is extended to double digits. Madison brings the ball up quickly. The X-Man, Xavier Graber, called for a carry after he split the defense. And now the press is in effect. And the ball is inbounded. Litton gets the ball and it's stolen away by Hemingway. Hemingway gets it to Graber. Graber drives by. By Balderson, the shot is up. That's no good. Rebound by Parker Dobson. Parker Dobson now drives the length of the court. He shoots this good, 30 to 18. Blunner has it. 4:26 remaining. Bringing the ball up. Xavier Graber is fouled by Parker Dobson, and that is his second foul. 
So far, Dobson is leading the way for the, uh, the Bobcats with 12. Gebhardt gets the ball on the inbound. It's good for his third point of the ball game, 30 to 20. Butter Asher gets the inbound. Parker Dobson had to take the Litton who shoots the runner, and it is good. Quickly, the ball is inbounded by Madison. Madison Graber with the shot inside the lane. It's good. Quick action going on here tonight in the Jefferson Elementary Center Big Gym. And we have a timeout called by Barry Goldenberg. 3.57 remaining in the ball game. Blenner has it, 32, Madison 22. For the Madison Mustangs, Xavier Graber is leading the way again. He has 13 points at this point in the ball game. Nate Sterling has two, has, excuse me, six points. Gebhardt, Noah Gebhardt, who had a big game last night, has three. Leonard Hassett gets the ball off the inbound after the May basket. They run the baseline ball and down to the park. Parker Dobson. Dobson ahead to Casey Litton. Casey Litton drives. Shot is blocked. He gets his own block. Shot, though, puts it back up. And on the second shot on the shot attempt, number 30, Hayden Sterling, who blocked the first shot, fouls the second shot. And with 3.49 remaining, Casey Litton at the line, shooting two. First shot is up. Sneaks it over the top of the front of the rim. And it's a 33-22 game. One shot. Litton shoots. Again, over the top of the front of the rim. And the basket is good. Rolls down in. Quickly, Madison brings the ball up again. Graber to Gebhardt. Gebhardt back to Graber. Who drives in. Nice little pull up. But the rim's not kind. And the ball is knocked out of bounds by the Bobcats and... Madison will have the ball with 3.37 remaining. In dead man's corner on the bleacher side. The ball to be inbounded by Gebhardt. Gebhardt to Hemingway. Hemingway tries to get through but travels with the basketball. And the ball goes to the Bobcats. Balderson ahead to Dobson. Dobson carries. Mason Hemingway was the man that made that play. Even though it won't show up as a statistic, he went in for the steal. Dobson saw the little guy trying to get the steal and tried to dribble over him, and that caused the carry. Inbound by Madison to Gephardt to Hemingway. Hemingway kicks it down inside to the block. Ball kicked back out to Hemingway. Hemingway to Graber. Graber to Gephardt on the right wing. Open. Shot no good. And the ball is knocked out of bounds by Madison. And it will be Blunder has the basketball. Madison's pressing. Hemingway guarding Litton. Litton drives by him. Litton shoots. Stops no good. Rebound by Gebhardt to a head to Graber who drives the court. That shot is no good. Balderson for the Bobcats gets the rebound. Pushes the head to Litton. He loses control of the ball, and it will be Madison basketball. 2.55 remaining. Madison inbounds the basketball. Graber to the left wing to Hemingway. Back to Graber on the left wing. He looks to drive right into the paint. Stops no good. Rebound Parker Dobson. Dobson looks ahead. Dribbles down the court. Nobody picks him up. He shoots. No good. Rebound by the Bobcats through Davis. It's no good. Dobson rebounds. It's no good. Eddie now with the rebound. Kicks it out to Case and Litton. Litton shoots. He's up a three. There's no three-point shot, however. Shot is short. And it's rebounded by the Mustangs. Mustangs. Gebhardt drives down the right side. Matt 
shoots the ball. It's no good. Rebound by Davis. Davis to Kaysen Litton, who drives to Glenbrook Court. It's no good. He gets his own rebound, and we have a foul on number 30. Hayden Sterling called for the foul. We have a timeout called by Barry Goldenberg. Minute 55 left on the clock. Butter Hassett is leading 34 22. If the results of this game hold up, Leonard Hassett would play Williamstown tomorrow night at 5.30 in the Final Four matchup. Both teams are now out on the floor, and we have an inbound underneath the basket. Balderson eyes the court. The ball is knocked out of bounds by Madison, and now you have an inbound on Dead Man's Corner from the side. Balderson, the inbound from Dead Man's Corner, kicks the ball out to Eddie. Eddie tries to push the ball down to Dobson, but the ball is stolen by Gebhardt. Gebhardt dribbles up, but he's fouled from behind by number 23, Parker Dobson. That is his third foul. 34-22, and Coach Adam Dobson has done a really good job of managing the foul situation here. There are four players currently with three fouls. Minute 38 to go. Gephardt gets the ball off the dribble. We falls to the floor. We have a tie-up and alternating possession under the basket for the Madison Mustang. The x man for Madison, Xavier Graber, to inbound the ball. He inbounds to Hemingway. Hemingway back to Graber. Graber looks to drive, and the ball is knocked out of bounds. And the ball is given over to Blenner Hassett with a minute 29 remaining. Madison in the press and desperation mode. Parker brings the ball across half court to Case and Litton. Case and Litton drives down. Nice little shot. That might be the backbreaker right there. 36-22, Blenner Hassett. Graber brings the ball across over to Gerber. Excuse me, to Gebhardt. And Gebhardt with a nice shot off the glass. A minute five remaining. Leonard Hassett gets the ball. Jason Litton. Jason Litton brings it across and then brings the ball out. Parker Dobson runs time off the clock. Now it's Balderson. Balderson is fouled. And with 50.2 seconds remaining. Xavier Graber with a foul. And both teams now are emptying the benches. Butter Hassett will advance and play tomorrow night at 5.30. Forgive me, but I just, I don't know all these names. All, we had 10 kids come in and out, so I'm not going to get them all. I'll try to get names as we go along. Inbound at the number zero. That's Isaiah Daggett. He shoots. Rebound by Landon Stevens. He hits a basket. He's excited. Ball is inbound at the number five. That is uh, Braden Lancala. Lancala passes ahead. And the ball is shot by Madison. That shot was by number four. Kian McDonald. McDonald rebound is by Blenner Hassett. That shot is by Tyler Wingrove. Lankala pushes ahead again. Shot by Braden Lankala. 
Runner has to get the ball. Number three, that is Tyler Wingrove. Scrum on the floor. And now we have two more subs coming into the ball game for the Madison Mustangs. Number two, Andrew Ross. Number 23, Asher Bryan. Six seconds remaining on the clock. Mustangs had a very good season this year. They'll finish the season nine and four in league play. The Bobcats will advance. We had a final basket there by the Bobcats. Number zero, Isaiah Daggett off the inbound play. Runner has it. Will win 40 to 24 and advance to play Williamstown tomorrow night. Runner Acid ups their record to 11 and 3. 